today we're going to talk about handling techniques um, for your arboreal gecko. Um, that being a crested gecko, a gargoyle gecko, Ochi. Or in this case, this is a chihua, another cousin of those gecko groups. Um, so as you can see, I am have open hands and I'm kind of letting him do what he wants. Um, he's always going to jump forward and you can tell um, by his body language kind of what he's going to be doing. If you give him a space to go, he might go there. Um, what you don't want to do is squeeze your animal or constrain him in any way. That makes them feel nervous. It makes them think that you're potentially a predator and that's not what you want them to feel. Um, so just giving them the space to kind of climb around without squeezing um, makes them feel really safe. Um, so what you don't want to do is stuff like this. See how he's struggling? Because um, this is what a predator would do in the wild, right? It would grab it and constrain it. And we don't want him to feel that way. So we keep open hands and just kind of let him walk around and let him jump. He's always going to go forward and up. Um, I mean, sometimes they go down, but generally I want to climb up to the top of the tree. That way they can see what's going on and they feel safer as he is here. Um, I'll introduce you to another gecko who hopefully will be a little more jumpy so you can give us a better idea of how to handle your gecko. Thanks, Leopold. I'm going to stick you right here for now. This is Pumpkin. Pumpkin is a gargoyle gecko that I just woke up, so we'll see if he does a little more jumping. But essentially what you're going to want to be doing is just having flat, open hands, and that way you can kind of catch where he goes. You always want to be sitting when you're handling your gecko. That way if he jumps and he misses, he doesn't fall five feet. He just falls, you know, maybe a foot and a half. And they're made for that. They are jumpers and climbers, so they're pretty good at hopping around. Um, so essentially, don't squeeze your gecko. Pretend you're a tree and you should be good.